Hi, I'm Gary Aguiar, and it's with great pleasure that I present to the stewards at McKenzie Willamette Medical Center the award for Outstanding Grievance Representation. Let me tell you a little bit about our story there. So in December 2015, about four years ago, we had one officer and four stewards. None of the stewards were trained, and the bargaining unit was about 350 members. And so we gradually expanded the number of stewards so that over the last two years now, we've had more than 38 stewards, which was our goal of having at least one steward uh, for every 10 nurses. And those stewards are engaged in a multiple, uh, multiple activities that I wanna to explain to you. Um, one of them is that they are able to identify a issue campaign. So whenever a steward calls me, I'm, they are trained now, they understand that they need to be ready to answer who else cares about the issue and what are they willing to do about it? And so this happened, uh, one example is in 2017, the employer unilaterally imposed mandatory call in our uh, women's health department. Our leaders there, Angie Kimani and, and Candy Bigby and others, Leah Emmett and uh, others, um, rounded the hospital to explain to other nurses what this meant. Other nurses um, supported them by signing a petition. Um, and I'll tell you about that in a minute. Um, we held a grievance meeting to try to address it with the employer. And at that uh, grievance meeting, 22 nurses showed up from four departments. Um, the HR director at that meeting lied to the nurses and bullied the nurses. That word got out and two weeks later she was fired. We then held a unity break where 100 nurses showed up and their supporters. We had the petition now signed by 75% of the nurses in our bargaining unit and we presented that to the, um, the HR, the new HR director. Um, eventually, months later, the women's health director was fired also because of bullying. Um, and so now the new management team at Women's Health um, regularly engages our, our stewards in Women's Health, asks them for advice before they make changes in, in policy. So that's one example of how we expanded the steward um, base has helped to build power. In addition to that, um, our stewards uh, perform all of the investigatory meetings and all of the step one grievance meetings. So we have nine stewards who are basically um, uh, uh, experienced and uh, willing to uh, do that, do those tasks. Um, and so they, uh, they take the calls to the investigatory meeting and most of them are experienced enough. They don't need to call me as a labor rep, although if they're difficult, they will. Um, but they have taken on that responsibility and it has helped those nurses because now they have an experienced nurse and a trained experienced steward in that meeting with them who are able to communicate with that manager um, speaking nurse. Um, and so uh, what that has done has increased our power in a couple of ways. Um, one is, is actually we now file fewer grievances. So for example, in 2017, we filed 15 grievances. But in the last two years, 2018 and 2019, we only filed seven grievances in each year because the employer now sees that we have stewards on top of these um, issues. So when there is a contractual violation, the steward has a conversation with the employer, the manager right away. And often we don't even need to file a grievance. The manager understands that we have power and we're right in our interpretation of the contract. Secondly, in 2019, um, oh, just, pardon me, it's, it, we've increased the success rate of our grievances. So prior to 2019, our success rate, the number of times we won a grievance was a bare majority, 53%. But last year, 2019, we won six of our seven grievances for a success rate of 86%. Um, and so building out the steward, the capacity in the steward base has allowed us to build issue campaigns. People and stewards have experience with that, but it also means that Nurses are being represented by other nurses as stewards in their investigatory meetings and in, in their step one grievance meetings. And we've had to file fewer grievances and won more of them as a result. So I'm just so pleased that Mackenzie Willamette stewards have been recognized uh, with the Outstanding Grievance Representative Award. Thank you.